Rose Colored Glasses, take one. Hi, I'm Dana. And I'm Angel. And you're watching Rose Colored Glasses with Lord and Lady Logan. In a world where people are quick to talk about the things they dislike, we want to keep it positive. So we'll be individually and collectively telling you about all the things we do like. We hope you enjoy the show. And if you do, please hit the subscribe button, tell your friends, and come back again. Hi everyone, I'm Angel Logan and thank you for joining me today on Rose Colored Glasses with Lord and Lady Logan. One place that Dana and I enjoyed visiting before the pandemic hit was the Butterfly Place in Westford, Massachusetts. In case you're wondering, it's exactly how it sounds, a special place for butterflies to live. If you've never gone to an indoor butterfly garden before, you might think it would be kind of boring, especially for guys but you'd be pleasantly surprised at just how amazing this experience is. First of all, you need to dress appropriately because once you walk into their domain, you'll be hit with tropical temperatures, which are ideal for their habitat. Then you'll see all kinds of greenery and beautiful butterflies flying around all over the place of every size and a spectrum of colors and wing designs. It kind of makes you giggle at first because they'll actually land on you but then you'll start to feel a type of comfort and calm that comes over you from their gentle manner and the serene atmosphere that they create. They're just awe-inspiring little creatures that begin as fuzzy little caterpillars that ultimately transform into winged beauties, flying around and painting the world with their brilliance. I know that this sounds a little hokey, but you just can't imagine the sense of peace that you'll feel when they're flying all around you, landing on your shoulder, your hand, and yes, even your head. That was a little strange and awkward at first, but then kind of cool. It makes me so happy to see butterflies flying around. If you'd like to see more butterflies within your surroundings, there are a number of flowers that you can plant that specifically attract them, such as milkweed and marigolds. However, if you're anything like me and you don't have a green thumb for gardening, the next best thing is getting a butterfly feeder. Just like bird feeders, there are some designed specifically for butterflies. All you have to do is fill them with a type of nectar that you can purchase and the butterflies will find their way to your yard. These are items that you can purchase directly from the shop at the Butterfly Place or from their online shop on their website. Trust me, seeing butterflies all around your yard will definitely make you happy. Did you know that butterflies are woven into the fabric of our world's biological community, otherwise known as our planet's ecosystem? I'm sure you've heard a lot lately about climate issues, 
global warming, the need to be greener in our practices, and how much we need to preserve our ecosystem. It's hard to wrap our minds around what that means universally, but what does that mean for us personally, and how are butterflies involved? Just like bees, butterflies are major pollinators flying from one flower to another, helping our flowers and plants to grow. And while that may seem like a small thing, this is actually an essential part of how our ecosystem functions and sustains itself. Plants produce oxygen, which is what our environment needs. The more oxygen and clean air that we have within our atmosphere, the better our climate will be, preserving our planet as a whole. I never realized that butterflies played such a big part in our overall existence, but then it isn't really so surprising that something so beautiful would contribute so much. I couldn't tell you the names of all the butterfly species, but I don't think that you need to know their names to appreciate just how amazing they are. Dana and I took several photos during our visit to the butterfly place, and sometimes a picture is worth a thousand words. It's hard to believe that a small butterfly could have such a huge impact upon our environment. But we're all connected in one way or the other, and butterfly gardens like the Butterfly Place are committed to protecting our butterflies from the causes of their decline, such as deforestation and pesticides. Global climate change threatens their existence, but oddly, preserving our butterflies actually helps to restore balance to our ecosystem, which is only good for the environment. So visiting and supporting indoor butterfly gardens are small but meaningful ways to do our part, enjoy ourselves, and appreciate some of nature's beauty. Thank you for watching. If you click on more in the description section below right above the comments, you'll find links and information about our channel in today's show. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel if you're enjoying our show. And I hope that you'll visit again to take a look through our rose-colored glasses. Until next time.